bringing you breaking news of an armed robbery that started in Reno Valley with uh, five suspects uh, believed to be involved, shooting a, a clerk there and then going on the run. They were detained by police. Three suspects are now in custody. One suspect actually led police on a very high-speed pursuit. He was eventually arrested on a baseball diamond in Watts. In the meantime, there's another suspect right here somewhere on this campus at Cal State Fullerton. That's why the students there are on lockdown. Classes no, no, have been canceled. Yeah. Another suspect believed to be uh, somewhere else uh, in the city, and uh, Fullerton uh, police right. all yeah. over this yeah. Yeah. Time, and also yeah. SWAT as well involved. Yeah. Uh, other news to tell you about, there is a big storm that is, uh, I think it's actually here now officially, right, Jackie Johnson? It is, Rick. Uh, in fact, uh, the rain starting to fall right now, light rain showers. The heaviest amounts will be moving through into the overnight hours, which is great news. However, if you've got to get up and get on the roadways tomorrow morning, give yourself some extra time. The roadways will be split, and not only will we have rain, but we've also got uh, snow falling to the lower levels. We're not going to see a lot of snow uh, in the lower levels, but above 6,000 feet, we could see about 10 inches of snow. So it's a pretty good uh, snowstorm. Good news for the skiers and borders, of course. But looking at the radar, you can see heavier rain starting to move in right now across the 101 as you head into Ventura County. And where you're seeing the pink in the mountain areas, that's rain starting to turn to snow, so a wintry mix. And as those temperatures drop, it's the overnight hours and more of that moisture starts to move in. Uh, that's when, of course, the snow will start. So uh, first off, we want to talk about this winter weather advisory for the mountains of L.A., Ventura, San Bernardino, and Riverside counties. That will take us through 4 p.m. tomorrow. And then you mix in the wind. So you've got the snow and the blowing snow making for low visibility levels. And again, the snow, uh, not only the snow and the blowing snow, but we are looking at those temperatures on the chilly side. So we've got a light rain that is moving in. Overall, about a quarter to a half inch rain from the coast to the valleys, about an inch of rain in the mountain areas. Uh, three to six 